Hello and welcome to this recording. And this is a review of GRL Level 3. So why GRL Level 3? Many people think that it's a good program, which absolutely, it's a good program. Do I recommend this program? Yes, I recommend it for those people that love to do storm tracking and love to, uh, you know, monitor uh, severe weather and stuff. Um, I haven't had this software very long. Uh, got it as a early birthday gift. So it was, you know, basically something that I've used and I've used it now uh, since then. And it has been a rock star of a program. Uh, now I do use, um, web-based radar programs, and I have in the past. Um, do I recommend those? Yeah, I mean, I, I recommend those if you can only invest in web-based programs, and there are some free ones uh, out there. And, uh, but GRL level three, it's very accurate. It's got a lot of feature set in it. And one of the things that I like is the fact that it updates for you rather quickly. So the update is every two minutes. Um, so every two minutes, it will have a new image uh, update for you and everything. And that's one of the things that I do like about this is that it's constantly doing the update. It's gonna, um, you know, complete the update and go from there. Uh, do I recommend this program? Like I said, absolutely. Uh, the pricing point for this program is about, uh, by the time you put the money down on it, uh, you're looking at about uh, 85, um, 80, 85 dollars total uh, for the package um, for the software itself. And that's just for one license. Now, if you need to get more than one license, you have to specify that in uh, the uh, area where you go to check on quantities. Uh, you need to make sure that you specify that when you um, make the uh, purchase for the, uh, the software that you specify um, how many copies of the uh, software that you're wanting and everything. And that way it will automatically generate uh, that many license keys. But I have spoken with the company's uh, Facebook uh, page there. I've spoken with them, and they actually responded to, responded to me really quickly, even before I bought the software. And one of the things I did ask was, can you use just one key on more than one PC? And I got the answer rather quickly, and that answer was yes. So even if you get one license key, and you're the only one using it, Okay, you're the only one using that key and you're using it on computers that you own and all of that, the answer is fine. But if you're gonna gift it for other people, meaning like if you plan on giving a copy of the software to somebody else as a gift, then yeah, I would recommend uh, getting at least more than one key so that if uh, like a family member or another ham operator uh, that you know wanted a copy of it and you wanted to gift it as a Christmas gift, birthday gift, whatever, uh, that's what I would recommend is getting more than one copy of uh, the software and registering it. Uh, registration process was really simple. Um, after I got the email saying that it received the confirmation, the confirmation from it, it instantly sent me the registration key. Now, I'm not going to show you that in this, but I am going to tell you it is easy because all you have to do is just copy and paste the code and it will instantly tell you that the um, uh, limit is removed, meaning the trial, lim <clears throat> trial limit is removed from it. They give you, when you first install the program, they give you a, <clears throat> geez, Throats uh, acting up today. Sorry about that. They give you a 21 day trial to test out the program and see if you like it. Um, and I did. I tested it out until the close to the end of the 
21 day trial and then right at the um, fourth day, right about day four was when I basically said, yes, this is going to be the, <clears throat> this is going to be the top dog. And, um, and the reason why, you know, I didn't, you know, my dad was the one that said, you know, you really want to test this thing before you just flip the switch and say, yeah, you want to make uh, the buy because I had bought some software in the past and those companies had recently shut down. They're no longer making the software. So make sure that when you're searching for radar software, find out how long that they've been in operation. This particular program has been in operation now for 10 years. The company uh, has been in operation now for 10 years and they continue to make uh, updates to this program uh, and everything. The thing I have not heard from yet is you're supposed to register as a um, owner of the software once you get it. And you go to the owner forum on their system and you register and you don't hear back from them. And that was another thing. I sent them a message on their Facebook saying, you know, I registered to your owner forum and I have not even been approved. And somebody came back to me and said, well, unfortunately, there's hardly anybody ever in that forum anymore, so you probably will not get approved. And uh, yeah, so that's why I strictly recommend using the Facebook page. And, you know, they're not bothered by you asking more than one question. I mean, there's a couple of people that may be bothered by it, but don't take it too personally. Uh, that's just my opinion. Um, pros and cons. There's a lot of pros. I can go into it. Like I said, worth the money. You should buy it. Keep the thing in a safe place, meaning keep your the email in a safe place or whatever. Um, keep it in an account that you can go and look at it later. Say if you need to get a license key, get the key again and install it on another thing. Keep it there. Um, and uh, Basically, that's it. I don't have anything else other than say, uh, you know, go out and find the program. If you like it, like it. And uh, be sure to leave me your comments below this video. Um, I will provide a link to the GRL Level 3 uh, software in the uh, description below this video. Have a wonderful day, everyone.